Jungfrau Yachts, 11,000 feet up in the Swiss Alps, and we've got an amazing vista behind us. And not only does this draw some 700,000 tourists every year, it draws a lot of filmmakers. And why not? This is a perfect movie backdrop. Kerry Sanders back with us now with that part of the story. Kerry? Well, not only is it gorgeous here, but it may actually appear something like, I know that scene before, because it's right over there, just one mountain over, which is quite popular because, well, I'll give you a clue, Bond, James Bond. There's only one way to get to Pizgoria, by cable car. And were it not for James Bond, this engineering marvel at 9,000 plus feet might not even exist. Half built and out of money, the movie producers completed construction here to make the 1969 Bond flick on Her Majesty's Secret Service. And no one knows this spot better than one of the most famous actors you've never heard of. Bond comes out here. That's Stefan Zurcher, then a 23-year-old extreme skier who was about to begin a life as a James Bond stuntman. In the days before Hollywood green screen, then computer animation. When people walk past you, they have no idea. A lot of that is the tank block. <laughs> Six action-packed James Bond movies have been filmed in Switzerland. But we found real life in the Alps is so peaceful, often the only thing you hear are the cowbells. But as peaceful as it is, for those with an inner James Bond yearning to get out, this is also a playground. From the zip line... growing sport in the Alps, paragliding. Oh my goodness. Wow. So that's like a death spiral he's doing over there, huh? You don't do that with passengers, do you? You do? Oh my god, a safe landing. Want a James Bond chase scene? Coast down the Alps on a scooter. But perhaps the most awe-inspiring movie-type moment to be had in the Alps, hiking across one of the glaciers here. I live at sea level. <laughs> I'm out of breath already. You never go on a glacier alone without a rope. My guide, Martin Sherman, nicknamed the Mountain Goat. On top of the glacier, he took me to 12,000 feet. This is Young Fier, 18 miles long, a half mile deep, and remarkably... We're moving. Because of gravity, this ice cube is slowly moving south about three feet a year. And unbelievably deep inside the glacier, we found a little-known ice bar. My choice, of course, shaken, not stirred. Okay, so if Matt will indulge this fantasy, I will... And only James Bond can do. I have a Bond girl here with me. Matt, I have a mission, and I have to find out whether she's a double agent. Did you not hear that I have four <laughs> bars on my blackberry? That means your wife can call you. All right? Gary Sanders, thank you cool. very much. When we come back, the only way to get from down there to up here.